About a year ago, I received a message from this guy named Ron who said he was some sort of internet security consultant. Ron told me that somebody was taking my pictures, creating these fake profiles to lure girls, and that I needed to call him to fix the problem. He sent me links to two different profiles. I contacted both of those websites, and so they proceeded to take them down. A month later, he emails me again and tells me there's another fake profile up, so I don't understand why you're not contacting me to fix this problem. After Ron contacted me a couple of times, I discovered that he didn't have a website, he didn't have any real legitimate business. This guy clearly was not who he said he was. He proceeded to email me and contact me a couple of times. I blocked this guy from anything that I could social media-wise. In one of the emails, he actually sent me pictures of myself with my nieces and nephews. How messed up is this guy? These are children. What really bothered me was when he actually sent me an email with all of my personal information in there. He had my home address. And that's when I realized, you know, this guy is sending out basically a veiled threat to me that if I don't respond to him, something bad is gonna happen. So about a month into this, I received some Facebook messages from some girl named Victoria. She began to alert me about these fake Dylan profiles that were out there and that she was supposedly in a relationship with this person. It's as if she had all the same information that Ron did. So I began to assume, okay, you know what? This crazy guy, Ron, is behind this profile as well. So after I blocked Ron and Victoria, he then realized he wasn't getting a response out of me, and he began contacting my girlfriend. He contacted her, said, I see through Facebook that you're dating Daniel, and there's some fake profiles out there with his likeness. You need to call me to fix this. The really weird thing was one of the emails he had sent to my girlfriend, he said, whoever is sending these emails is clearly maybe dangerous and mentally disturbed. And it's as if he was referring to himself.